Then here um, at Origadio, how we set ourselves apart, we've got the 10.4, which we've opened up so you guys can see the inside of it. Rarely will anyone ever do this, but we feel perfectly comfortable showing you guys the inside. So let's talk about some of the safe. Yeah, so you see, when we make our products, we make them to be very safe. Obviously, you know, sending them to America, you have to really be strict on safety because, you know, the, 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 the hazard of lawsuits and problems in America is very high. It's so, got our UL listing on it, right? Yeah, so basically the way we, initially we've designed this to be very safe. I mean, the batteries are all locked together. It's in a very enclosed, um, you know, seal. Uh, we've got a sealing on the top and the bottom of the batteries. The, 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 the actual wires to, to actually connect the, uh, the, the terminals are actually locked in. They're glued in, uh, they're soldered in, and then they're taped over as well. Got so our, this is very hard to remove. Then on the other side, right, we've got our space. We've got our isolated yep. chip set you over You can see there. here there's a huge space in between the batteries. So there's, very, there's, there's no chance, basically, that if, if any of these shop um, you know, terminals coming into contact with the battery, even if like a lot of stress or a lot of uh, banging around. We've got the auto short too, so when the 10-4 turns on, the lights will go on, and then after 10 seconds, it automatically shuts off. Yeah, it will off. turn itself off. Um, we've also got, you know, we, we, didn't, we didn't cut any corners when it comes to the safety chips that are on the chipset. Um, everybody thinks that all chipsets are made the same, but they're made t totally different. I can buy one chip in 100 different variations, you know, with 100 different prices, but we, we, we spare no expense when it comes to making sure that the thermal regulation chip uh, is at the highest standard. So basically that means if it senses any overheating, it will slow itself down or turn itself off. Um, you also have like a communication with the batteries. If it senses any problem coming from the battery, it will, it will disconnect and disengage um, any kind of power um, runoff from the battery. And then also there's a chip in here that is very high grade that communicates with your smartphone. Now one thing that is very common to cut out of these is, a, is the chip to actually communicate to the smartphone to see how much power the, the phone wants and how much battery the power bank's got left. So we've got a good chip in that that basically communicates at all times with the phone. And uh, if the phone wants more power, it will send as much power as it needs. And if it doesn't want so much power, it will slow down its charging speed and basically match what the phone wants. And, and that's something quite critical that a lot of the smaller, cheaper units leave behind. And on top of that, too, we got our trusted battery supplier. We do our drop testing. We got the battery aging. And on top of that, also, we got the plastic core, which keeps the temperature of the battery. Yeah, so unlike too. a lot of them that are fully metal, we chose to kind of seal this in plastic. And uh, that just means that if, any, if, if it heats up, the, uh, you know, the metal is not going to cause any like, heating, you know, overheating. And uh, yeah, that's many reasons why yep. I personally love the 10.4, but more importantly why it's safe and that's everything you need to know about the 10.4.